Okay, welcome to my laboratory. Uh, what you're looking at here is a power supply that's going to be supplying 19 volts. Actually, I wanted to say 18. Uh, 18 volts to this wireless transmitter that is going to be transmitting through this output loop over to this wireless receiver which has a light bulb in it and a DC power output. That DC power output is going to be going up to power this zero voltage switching flyback driver which powers this flyback which is then going to produce a little high voltage arc across those terminals right there. And those are about a centimeter apart maybe slightly more than a centimeter apart. I didn't bother to rig up a good set of Jacob's Ladder electrodes uh, because I'm basically just lazy. So, uh, so let's, let's go. Let's turn on this. Turn that off. Let's turn on the wireless power transmitter. And I think you can see that the... Uh, wow, did I just blow that out? Well, drat, it looks like I did blow out that little bulb. But anyway, let's see if we can proceed with the demo uh, in spite of that. Maybe we can, maybe we can. Yeah, okay. So even though the bulb is blown out, I'm still getting a DC output from that uh, wireless receiver, and it is still able to produce uh, enough input current to the flyback driver to result in a nice little noisy squealy arc across that one centimeter gap and it's striking and and, uh, and uh, extinguishing and restriking so there's 15 or 20 kilovolts there of high voltage at high frequency and uh, I could run all kinds of incandescent and other kinds of bulbs off of that all right and in spite of the fact that I blew out that bulb, we're still having good DC output. Thank you for watching.